Hello, welcome back to the Chris and Paige show. It maybe has felt like a little while since we've made a video. We haven't done that much shopping lately, but uh, we will be uh, showcasing our April Dollar Tree haul. I think the last one was in March, so um, I will go ahead and uh, get right into it. And uh, if you like dollar store hauls, you might want to consider hanging around and subscribing to our channel. So I will get going. I haven't organized anything, so I'm just going to pull out items and go from there. So uh, we got a little box of treats. Um, Chris likes the popcorn twists. Yeah, they're just as good as the, um, what do they call them ones? The, well, it's old Dutch. Old Dutch ones in the blue bag, yeah. Aren't they called popcorn twists? Maybe. Too? Yeah. Anyhow, yeah. they're pretty good. You get quite a large amount, yeah. I'd say. One or two fittings for me. <laughs> and some of the chips were on, uh, I think, 50 cents. Not these ones, I don't think. No. So sour cream and onion. Yeah, we got two of those because uh, we don't share, we don't so, share well. so well with that one. The, yeah, I find that the twists are puffier, so you seem to get more. The chips are, yeah, not a whole lot. That was a duplicate of these. What do they call these? Okay, sour cream <laughs> onions, they're rings, so they're like the... I call them Funyuns. Onions. I think that's an American brand, but or American... We're uh, praised for but them. You enjoyed but... them? Yeah, they're delicious. Were those ones on the clearance? No. Oh, okay. No. I think it was those two that I got. Okay. Yeah, I see a... 75 it's... cents. Okay. So not a huge... So they may be expired or, or crushed, but... So smoky bacon. But for 75 cents. Yeah, they do feel a little crushed, but... Yeah. Not, nothing that dip won't help with that. Yeah. Just mix them and then the a ketchup covered bridge that was on for 75 cents so there's not a lot of that either but all right so when we dollar tree haul with us if there wasn't a toy or two so this is from the trolls movie and this i just found i thought i better open this up so that i can show you what they look like and this box is huge and i'll show you how small the there's um, sun catchers, by the way, if I didn't mention that. So you get three in the box. And look at this. This is how big they are. I don't know why the box is so... Do you want me and, to bring it closer? And I'll also show... I'll show the back of the box because that's going to show what they look like. Okay. So, yeah. Then these are in the, together, so... Yeah. So that show, shows what they... So there seems like a cheap plastic. I'm not sure how well they're going to paint up, but... Too poppy and a barb. Yeah. So if you want to just throw those back in there. Uh, today is our niece's birthday and on the weekend we're just having a small family little birthday party. So I'm going to throw this in with her, um, her loot. She loves them birds. And I'm sure there's, oh, there's a few more here for her thought to put on the table for decor. What's with his weird tail? <laughs> I might have to mend him. He's coming apart. <laughs> oh, I should have investigated that a bit more, hey? But yeah, why would... Their tails aren't like that. <laughs> Anyhow, what is he? A toucan, I think? I'm not, yeah. I'm not the expert. I don't know nothing about birds. There should be, yeah, a flamingo. That kind of bird, I know what that is. So he looks like he's in better shape, but... I don't yeah. know, what do you call that? Is it like a foil? Well, it's like pom-pom material almost. Like pom-poms, like, or tinsel. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't notice how goofy that was. I don't know if it says on here. No, it doesn't say. I'll wrap his, his tail back up. There. And, uh... <laughs> and we always like these solar dancing guys. We don't need any more, but Chris said we don't have these ones. Yeah, we don't have a sloth. Uh, Wearing sunglasses on his forehead like he's cool. And uh, what do they call that? Life preserver? Solar? Yeah. And, and then this guy, pineapple. I just couldn't leave him. He He's like a pineapple wearing shorts. 
And he's got a drink in his hand and he's winking. So what is he going to do? Just kind of dance when he... Yeah, he just dance. His arms dance. So yeah. Collection of those. So they, the store we went to, they were quite stocked up with all their summer seasonal stuff. If you want to bring that closer, the yeah. two drying mats. They're kind of handy, so I wanted a couple extra when my other ones are in the wash. I like to change them up quite yeah. frequently. That one's got the flamingos on it. Oh, maybe I better... Put it that way so you can see the flamingos. And I just noticed something I didn't notice when I put the stuff on the conveyor belt. <laughs> I wasn't sure if we were going to get these here. Yeah, I've been seeing other people haul these. It's a, a bead tray for making jewelry. It's a little tiny, but I've always kind of wanted one. So it's got little uh, spaces there you can put your beads in so they're not rolling around when you're trying to make a necklace. That's handy. Yeah. And we like to have salads most every night. I thought this was kind of a nice size. Yeah. It's just, what do they call it? Melamine or... Mel Melaware usually or something. Yeah. Melamine. They had a few different prints. I think there was flamingos and maybe just other flowers. I'm not really sure. Okay. Kind of boring, just some paper towel. That was a better deal, it came with two, where the other one I had originally picked was just one. What do we got here? This was, if you, this comes with two, they're just a cleaning, I'm not sure if that one's a microfiber. Um, it just is 100% cotton. But it feels soft, it doesn't, yeah. it doesn't have that, um, where some, cheap microfibers stick to your dry hands yeah. this one feels nice that'd make a nice napkin yeah so my plan was to have it um hand for dusting but we'll see what do we got here chris it's it's kind of a scrubby thing i picked out it's um clean logic is the brand i don't know which way to tilt this um dual texture exfoliating body scrubber stretch fiber technology um, gently remove dull, dry, damaged skin. Antimicrobial product protection built in. So I wasn't sure if it was something I could wash, like in the wash machine and reuse. Oh, it says just to replace every 30 days. So, yeah. yeah. Just disposable. Just disposable or whatever, but, um, I, f I f like the poofies and stuff yeah. like that, so I thought I would try it. There was another one you got. Yeah, there's a few varieties in there. Well, you can show that yeah. one, I guess. So this is, I really like they have a men's poofy. It is uh, black and it has kind of a rubbery things on the stretchy handle. Um, they haven't had them in a while, but I found the quality was much better than some of the girly ones. Um, and, and when I'm throwing them out once a month or whatever. So one side of this has the mitten. mitten or poofy part and the other side has an elastic strap and a soft um washing thing so yeah it'll be neat to try it like you'd um you could put it on your hand now is that one is it meant for men or does it it matter? says men but oh, okay and there's probably another i one. don't know how those can be gendered if you're washing <laughs> your body but <laughs> yeah. whatever yeah makes me feel more manly <laughs> oh jeez Okay, so for the birthday party, this is a, what do they call it? It's a, a paper lantern. And so this is something she could hang up in her, you know, her bedroom after or whatever. And it's got a, a toucan or something like that. Um, it does need some batteries. So I'll make sure I got oh, batteries in it before we go. So it lights up? Yeah, oh. it's got a light in it. That's cool. Yeah. Okay. And this, they only had the one flavor, Celestial Seasonings. Uh, what do they call it? Sugar Plum? Yeah. Sugar Plum Spice Holiday Tea. So I've never even seen that in stores before. Okay, 
many of these did we get? Two for sure. We were wondering if they still make these anymore, and not sure if they're in grocery stores, but um, the smart. Yeah, candy. simply. Yeah. Okay. Oh. That's smart. Well, it used to be smart, but now they call it simply. Oh. Yeah, made with cauliflower three cheese. They look like they have a goofy shape. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. Well, we'll have so, to. So a dollar twenty-five is not really a deal when sometimes craft dinner is a dollar, but you don't. We haven't seen that kind in a while. So I'm leave that aside because there might be more in here yet. I picked up, uh, these are wooden embellishment for card making. I just use, um, like, stamping ink to color them or whatnot. Seems that they're kind of rough up there. Um, what would you call it? A every time staple? Yeah, repurchase. Repurchase. Yeah. Pages. Bath time salt. salt. And I really like the, the lavender scented, I don't know if the brand name has changed, but yeah, this smells better than what the previous kind of... Yeah, this is Body Co, and the other one is like Allergy, I think. Oh, okay, so it is a different brand. Yeah, sometimes. It depends, yeah, because it's, it's a whole purple bag, the other one. So I got four of those. And that was another scrubby deal. Okay, that's like a square. Yeah, Clean Logic Exfoliating Body Scrubber Stretch Fiber Technology. Same kind of stuff. Yeah. Thought I'd give it a try. Brands with Braille, it says on the back. We'll have to hmm. investigate that further. Okay. I will show these stickers, but I wanted to make sure I had most of them out before... Um, if you want to show this, it's oh, a, yeah. uh, like an adjustable solar... Solar stake light. Th this was $1.50. So it's got the solar deal on the top and then the light there. And we thought it would be really good to put out in our front planter. They're not really... Oh, it just snapped into place there. Um, in our front planter, and then we could point it at the window. It comes with uh, batteries, it looks like. You just got to pull the tab. And then... We could hang something in the window, like at Halloween we like to put something in the window. So then people can see the the thing in the window, I guess. Because <laughs> it'll be lit. If you want to talk oh, about these. Yeah. These are on for 50 cents. Because they expire in April here. And I've never seen these anywhere. Like, I guess we don't go to a grocery store much. Because we usually do Instacart or just... Shop online, pick it up. And I've been having a bean craving because <laughs> I went to Taco Time twice in the last few months. And I don't know what I'm ordering. For some reason, I never get the bean burrito I asked for. But anyway, so we had this tonight. We mixed it with uh, some stir-fry beef and some other vegetables. And this and uh, some this, rice packets from and this comes, has Dollar some Tree. And green peppers in it. Usually. Yeah, and a little spice. It was It was fantastic. It was really good. So we got numerous amounts there. Uh, I bought them all. I won't count them as you won't have much interest in knowing the quantity, but something to look out for if you're interested in. Uh, just for um, traveling, just a toothpaste to have on hand. I thought there was no point in getting the small uh, travel size toothpaste because it's the same price as a big one. So. Yeah. And this seems like a newer it's coconut oil. Yeah. A new variety. I'm making a mess here all over the floor. Um, this was in like the seasonal stuff where they have like the ketchups and relish and mustard. So kind of a tiny, but we like to bit bigger ones, but sometimes the tiny ones are good too. It's easier for me to pour. Yeah, use it in cleaning and laundry and... More beans. Um, and then recently I heard that for my skin condition, I'm supposed to dilute some vinegar and use that on my sores. So I'm going to try that too. Here's another pot party decor. Inflatable bird. This is a decoration, not a toy. Well, okay. We'll let her know it's not a toy, <laughs> but I'm sure it will be. Um, he looks like that bird from, is it Aladdin? 
I, I was trying to figure that out in the store. Yeah, that... Um, yeah. What's that actor you don't like his voice? Oh. Um, that plays that bird. I can't think of it. What the name. hell is his name now? I'll put it on the screen when I remember. Yeah. But yeah, I don't, Great actor. I don't like his voice. Yeah. He was in like that Problem Child movie. Yeah. Wasn't that... And I always like to buy, I don't need any more of these either, but I always like their, their seasonal decors. I just put on the front door. Sorry, the ribbon seems to be kind of twisted on me, but there's two pineapple and a strawberry. They had a couple of varieties. They had one with like uh, a lime and a strawberry. And and uh, shoes are, are like oh, uh, flip flop flip -flop yeah. shoes. Yeah. But we liked this one. Yeah. Well, and the one was weird. It had, like, it had, like, what, uh, two pineapples and a... Well, and, this, is two, this is two pineapples. Oh, two pineapples. The other one had, it was a pink pineapple and a strawberry. <laughs> and then the lime and then the this sandal. And it's just a little bottle of Thousand Island dressing. They also had it in ranch... And Italian, I think. I think that was all the... And that's a good size for us, because we don't go through a lot of dressings. Or we like... The two of us, we like different kinds, right? Yeah. yeah. So... Uh, this was a... Uh, everyone pronounced it different. Worcestershire. Worcester. <laughs> yeah. I didn't read what the brand was or anything. Oh, it's like I think it's just the Dollar, tr Dollar Tree brand. Supreme something Supreme. Usually that and soy sauce, and we're not too fussy with the flavor of it. And these are just, um, like disposable, like food prep gloves. We use this for a variety of, mm -hmm. of stuff. It's kind of hard right now to find gloves that we like. And yeah, it's like still, Walmart and stuff. they're still not in stores. Lysol wipes came back for a while, but. Just another vinegar. Yeah. Oh, and just uh, a cornstarch, nothing too exciting. We have like Epicure pouches, like the sweet and sour stir fry mixes, and calls for cornstarch. And we're not bakers, so it's not something we had on hand. Oh, and then this is just another of those poofy, this one yeah. is a black one. And this was a score Chris found in the toy all. Oh, this mm -hmm. is also a gift for little one. So it's the Wild Republic brand, which I hear is a good brand. Yeah, I guess she really likes that brand. Usually yeah. at Dollarama, they have a little bit bigger plushies that are usually four dollars. So I thought dollar twenty-five. I think they unless they were dollar fifty. I think they were only dollar twenty-five. Yeah, because usually they'd have a sticker for the dollar fifty. But um, what did they call it? Like uh, a, what, the one on your left hand or right hand there is a zebra shark, and the other one is a tiger shark. Hopefully I'm yeah. showing I can him. I can bring him closer, too. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I can't make that. I'll, maybe I'll insert a little uh, um, Jaws music there. I was just seeing if there was anything here. Anyway, so the little one is real excited about these that brand, that brand of animals. And she's got a pile of birds. And for Sting, stingray, in that yeah, one. and for Easter she got a hedgehog, yeah. and he was big. He was he was a very large stuffy from another, Dollarama. Sorry, cut you off. Go ahead. It's another okay. um, party item. It's just a tablecloth with birds on it, of course. Yeah, that white bird's on there, so that'll be good. Cause we didn't buy the white bird decoration. picked up some nail polish. I think it's just the LA Color brand. Is that all of them? Is that LA Color as well? That this brand? is LA Color. Oh, uh, this one. This one's a different brand. This is a. This one has a built-in hardener. It says. Oh, okay. I don't know what that color is. Some of them just have a number. Yeah. Cheap ones sometimes don't have. This any. is mellow. I think that one's mellow. 
And then I can... And then this one's a different brand. That's the one I... This one is Billy Cosmetics Nail and Apple. Never heard of that. It's a very nice blue. It's called Myconos Blue. M-Y-K-O-N-O-S. Learned a new word today. Mm -hmm. Learned it. These other ones are the LA color, I believe. I thought the bright colors for summer would be nice. Yeah, yellow. So I'm not really sure how the LA colors nail polish is for quality, but... Tart. This one's called Tart. And the last one... Well, this one looks like it's got confetti in it. Sparkly. That's cute. That's... That reminds me of the eight, the eighties and nineties well, when we why had I picked it out. I thought all of them were like that. We had uh, neon stuff, candy coated. Nice. Yeah, so you'll have to take them to Darcy when you do your next nails. <laughs> okay. And play with those. I am nearly done, saving the good stuff for the last. Ah. Uh, have to make you watch the whole video, right? Uh, so see the the favorite items. So. Not a lot of new stickers, but I took what there was. These are kind of foily. I'm not sure how well it's going to pick up, but we can try. They just look like patterns or... Yeah, like marbly or... They're... It's... It's something special. Like, the goldish ones, they kind of look like those... What are they called? Stagnatites or whatever? Sure. They were had that word on Jeopardy the other night. Oh, jeez. And these are kind of like the same kind of finish they look like tiny little tiles yeah this is like kind of a navajo kind of deal going on there and feathers and stuff and arrows it's really pretty and then this one is more shapes geometric shapes and and triangles and such really really neat stuff and then i was told that you know i don't need any more flowers but these were new flowers i don't have these flowers so there's there's three different uh Designs the sunflowers are kind of my favorite out of the three. These are yeah, they're really neat. They kind of have that gold trim on them. Oh, look at the purple ones! <laughs> Holy man! I hope I get a card with one of those on it. And then the sunflowers. That's just beautiful. Mm -hmm. You have to make a card for Patty with the sunflowers. <laughs> Shout out to Patty. <laughs> All right, and. Some of you might know about the, like the little gnome. I don't know if mm. these are too big for for gnome um, fairy gardens. That's the word I'm trying to think. It's late, so I'm, my brain's mm -hmm. tired. But um, little beach pieces. So like back in, um, was it January when they came up with the candy carnival pieces that I was into? So now they're doing a beach theme. So not sure how they will... The size will um, work with our other stuff, but... Oh, and the other gardening type item I got was that oh, flag uh, stand. Yeah. And I I left it out on the deck because I oh, okay. had planned to put it out in the planter. But then it snowed. <laughs> but it's, yeah, it's fairly long. It's just a long stake, so it's probably hard to show anyway. Reusable. You could put different holidays on it or whatever. Yeah. So I think our store had all of the pieces that are in this little series i would assume i don't know if there's any that would be missing but and they had a couple quads they were still trying to get rid of too because uh -huh. we didn't buy the quad so this is pretty cute this seashell. is seashell like yeah it's just that light's too bright i'll turn the light down so we can whoop rocking and rolling <laughs> See, that it's got the nice, um, what do they call that, coral mm -hmm. above the doors? And there's a little starfish fish in the window. Really neat. Really, really cute. I'll just oh, the yeah, table. I can. Yeah. I just don't want to get them mixed up here with... And what would you call this, just a regular little beach house? Yeah, like a little beach house. Maybe it could be a beach outhouse, I don't know. Since they really like making outhouses. Yeah, they do. It's pretty cool. How, or, do, you how do you find the paint on these ones? Kind uh, of similar well, to the, 
well, this is like the brown overlapping on the blue and stuff, mm -hmm. but they are, they look a lot better than some of the other. Those, ones. um, Valentine's Day ones were pretty bad. Pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Not that I'm an expert painter. <laughs> Little umbrella. Umbrella. Got it. Oh, it's got a little shell on the sand there, the umbrella. And this one's pretty cute. I don't know, the size is kind of big, I think, for the rest of the piece. It's kind of like how the quad's kind of large. Yeah. <laughs> little VW bug there. Sta maybe or maybe it's supposed to be like a station wagon, like an old woody. Well, it's kind of like a bug. I don't know why the color is just not coming through. Not coming through great. It's kind of like a Oh here we go. Kind of like a robin's egg blue. Yeah. What'd you say? Maybe it's just reflecting off of the light there. But he's pretty cute. And he's got a little life preserver and a surfboard on top. They might be is it wakeboarding when it's a real short? Could be. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> We're no experts. And this is really cute. I wish they had a little bit more like like options like this. Yeah. Thing. Little Especially door. Especially if a person wanted to have a whole beach village, you kind of need more. Yeah. Garden, well, it makes like on the coffee table. Yeah. Then we only then we only have the tan or whatever pieces or whatever. And this is a beach chair. Oh, and of course a sailboat. Us and our love of nautical things. Mm -hmm. Look at that little life preserver on there. Pretty cute. Oh, and then we gotta hang those old flip flops up to dry on our tiny palm trees. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then I got five of the little rainbow walkways. Didn't know how many to get. Yeah, they had a pile of them, but... <laughs> Not a true rainbow, but rainbow-esque. Close. Close enough. So I think I got everything. So once again, we'd like to thank you for stopping by and, uh, Hope you saw something you'd like and uh, let us know if you like Dollar Tree hauls and we'll keep doing them. Have a great day. Bye.